We have been leaving you, as you know, at <laughs> two o'clock Eastern time. We will not today because of the match that you're seeing, number one in the world, and John McEnroe. It is five to eight in Paris, and very interestingly, uh, Ivan Lendl and Steffi Graf tonight are being honored at a dinner here in Paris, as you know. It's an eight o'clock call for an 8.30 dinner. He's not going to make it. The ITF uh, acknowledged the world's top players at a dinner in Paris every year. A little too much starch on that Lendl forehand for McEnroe to volley. That's great. That's great, man. That's Wide serve to Lindell's forehand. Well, John missed two of those tries in the tie break. And on that one, Lindell handled it easily. So I, I, don't, I just don't think John should be throwing that one out to Lindell too much right now. Toss is still a little off for John to be making that one. A little too low, a little bit to his right. That's what, which is what he had been doing early in this French Open. Oh! used to be John's toss never budged and he's got to get it back to that time but it was always in the same exact spot he's got a long way back still two break points for Lendl McEnroe wasn't broken in the first set and he broke Lendl in the first game behind an outstandingly good hustle, but then did lose his next serve game. So we're back even on serve, but he has a chance for Lendl to go ahead. Again, it's that one to Lendl's forehand. I think John's just got to fade that one. Lendl seems to really be picking it. He was waiting for that one, and he seemed to have so much time and swung so easily at it that it must have been scary for John just to see it. Three games to one for the number one seed and the title holder of the French Open. McEnroe broken twice in the match. Both of them in the set. Pretty good effort to rush Lendl off a good deep first serve. Lendl's only come in eight times, but he hasn't lost. You know, when he comes in, he's pretty much got the point one, doesn't he? McEnroe, on the other hand, look how many times he's come in. It's the only play he's got.
saw John. He just made a move with his racket, like, God, I could, I should have taken that in the air. But it was a beautifully placed lob. It was going to give him trouble, even if he had taken it in the air. Open Tennis Championships. This is Ivan Lendl, the number one player in the world, and decided to win this championship against John McEnroe of the United States. McEnroe won the first set 7-6 in the tiebreaker. Lendl leads it three games to one now. It is 30 all in the second set. Cliff Drysdale with Mary Carrillo on the stadium court. Jim Kelly, Fred Stolle, court number one. Andrea Joyce with Paris Postcards. It is minutes after 8 o'clock at night in Paris. I judge that we will have one more hour, maybe an hour and 10 minutes more of tennis left in the day just from a light standpoint because the clouds still hang ominously overhead. Game point for Lindell. And if they don't hold rain, then they darken things at least. Double four. McEnroe has three. Lindell's already crossing to change ends. McEnroe is not happy with the call. Let's see whether Richard Kaufman will get the lines person to get out of the chair and check it. He has. Points to the mark. Confirms that it's wide. Game for Lindell. Four games to one now in the second set for Lindell. First set for McEnroe. But let's go over to court one and check in with Jim Kelly. What's going on over there, Jim? Cliff, uh, just a few seconds ago, this was game point. Chesnikov in the near court, Pat Cash in the far court. All square, one set apiece. We're in the third set. Pat Cash won the first set, 6-2. Chesnikov, a similar score, 6-2 in the second set. And we're all square, one game apiece in the third set. The match a little over.